Hi YouTube, long time no see me. <laughs> so yeah, it's been <clears throat> it's been it's been a long time actually. It's been a very long time since I actually vlogged for this channel. Oh my goodness, so much has happened. I mean, so much has happened. I mean, so much has happened. So one of the reasons why I've been away is because I was really angry. I was really going through it with Google. Google was trying to screw me over. Um, so. I got monetized, I think, in July, right? And then in August, I reached the verification threshold and I had to now verify my identity. So they kept asking me to send my ID. And I'd send my, them my ID and they didn't want to verify it because obviously I am located in South Africa, but my ID is issued in Zimbabwe. So I'm like, what do you guys want? Do you want a picture of a visa? Do you want a picture? What do you want? And they're like, no, you can only submit an ID or a copy of like a, a rent receipt. So I kept submitting it because my id is not going to change and i told them my id is not going to change so i don't know what you guys want me to do and so <clears throat> ultimately i failed verification and they shut down ads on my channel so now i was asking them to review it and i'm like well is there really a person that can review my account on their own like just check my details because the details are not going to change i can't send you any other id because i don't have any other id id document or driver's license if i had a south african id i would have sent that but i don't have one and then um yeah this went on for months guys because imagine from august september and now we're in october and my ads are shut down i'm not making any income off my channel and it's, it's just things are just all over the place so i ultimately ended up shutting down my adsense account and i reopened one linked to my husband so my husband does have a south african id so yeah we're essentially starting from scratch i basically lost all the money i made it was it was about 500 rands, about 30 something dollars that I made in that first month of verification. But you know what? It's better to just lose that $30 and start actually earning income than hold on to the $30 and you're not going to get anything after that. So now we're back. We are monetized again. And your, your guys, I don't want to lie. Google just, it like was so disheartening. I didn't even want to make content or sit down and edit or do anything because I was like, why are you trying to be in my bag though? Like, why are you doing this to me? And it's not like I, I'm on YouTube. It's like just for the money. That's the thing. But it was just disheartening that I don't have control over my own account and they're just doing this to me. And you know, it just became so personal. I'm like, you're doing this to me because I'm an immigrant. And <laughs> it was just hectic times, hectic times. But anyway, guys, um, I've been up to a lot. Um, I have been vlogging here and there. Um, so let's just go through some of the things that I did in the past few weeks. Um, so that, yeah, you guys can just see what I've been up to if I have footage of it. I've been exhausted, guys. I've kicked up, I've opened up different, I've like expanded my businesses in different forms and I've been working. Like when I say I've been working, I can start working at like 10 in the morning and I wake I, I start working at 10 in the morning you might think it's late but that's because I tend to sleep between 5 and 6 every single day and I'm a person who needs <clears throat> at least 8 hours to sleep and it's so crazy because I'm trying also to have a relationship with my son and husband I can't just always be on my computer so like juggling all these things has been so hard for me so I work all these long hours so the other day I was just like you know what screw this I'm gonna go get my nails done that's when i went to get my nails done um but you know i had such anxiety in the nail salon i was just sitting in there like oh my gosh the things i could be doing right now because i was there for three hours i was like i'm gonna finish this i could have finished that but that's something i'm actually working to try and better but anyway um my husband my son and i we all went for a family spa date and it was so amazing uh, it was marty's first time getting a massage he absolutely loved it little boy knocked out halfway through the massage like we're in the room and we started hearing this guy is snoring he was so relaxed like he just slept on his bed he has his hair his head down as well just like we did and it was just so cute to see that my baby he, he understands the soft life so yeah here's some footage from from when we went to the spa hi youtube family how are you guys doing um i'm literally just coming to check in um i'm exhausted like the past month has been so hectic it has been so hectic and i'm probably going to come back and talk about it um later but right now i'm going to the salon my nails and my my feet look so terrible i would never show those on camera 
and I also just need to do my hair I need to get a massage I just need to do some shopping I just feel like I need to do stuff for me like just for this weekend you know just um, to do stuff for me to feel better because I haven't been able to do much for myself because I've just been working like sometimes I go to sleep at like five six in the morning and I'm up by ten and you know like I've got some new clients on my roster and <sighs> my business is just there's just so much going on so it's just been so hectic the month of October has been so bad I went to Zim I spent the whole time in Zim working um, I didn't even vlog I usually vlog when I go to Zim but this time don't vlog nothing um, and that's just because things have just been hectic so now I just want to do my hair you know do my nails have a massage just feel good about myself just you know um, catch up with myself so that's what this vlog is about that's what will be going on in this vlog so now I'm just gonna go to my um, nail tech and get my nails done I'll show you guys once I get back I'm not gonna carry my camera because <clears throat> I don't know I find it weird taking you know but I'll try to take some shots with my phone but yeah, so that's my day today. I will see you guys um, when I'm back and then we can figure out what else I'm going to do for myself so that I can start feeling better again. Um, if you're watching my weight loss um, channel, you need to keep up with that, guys, because some great, amazing things have been happening with my weight loss and I'm so excited. Um, but yeah, let me get going. I'm going to be late for my appointment. Okay, guys, I'm just getting ready to go to the spa now. Um, <clears throat> we're all gonna get some treatments done. I'm not sure what we're all gonna get. Um, I didn't see any kids' packages, but they said we can bring our kid and maybe he'll get a pedicure or manicure or something. I don't know, or a little baby massage. I don't know if they offer that in, in Thailand. <laughs> so, we're going, I'm going to the same place that I went for Women's Day because I need that kind of massage because, yeah, it is necessary. I'm, I've just been working so hard and yeah life has just been lifing so um yeah i'm just waiting for my husband to finish up and then we will be out and we'll go get our massages done and hopefully i'll feel better and i'll just have a slow day after that i'm trying to like not do too much work today so that i can also just feel the benefits of the massage also guys just look at my locks if you've been following my lock journey you know i started and they were like this they were really small but um they're growing like we're growing like these are going to be shoulder length very soon but yeah so that's what we're doing today um yeah it's just a chill day yesterday i went and i got my nails done um i got a touch of pink and like nude it's not focusing let me remove my face so it's pink and nude i don't know if you can really see i'll try to take a shot um against the sun but it's pink and my toes are also pink and i feel like a human being again so yeah um, um the last thing that needs to be done is my hair my hair needs to be done i'm also thinking of doing my lashes but yeah i'll try find time for that my hair the reason why i haven't done it is because my hair usually takes so long i'll be at the salon the whole day and i don't have a whole day to sacrifice yet because of all the deadlines i have with my various clients so um yeah guys that is me. Um, we're about to leave. Um, yeah, and I'll see you guys maybe when I come back or I'll just show you guys the spa. I mean, you've seen the spa before, but maybe you're going to get a different room because today it's a couple's thing. So, um, yeah, let me go. We're kind of late, about 10 minutes late, but it's not, it's probably like okay, going to take us 10 to 15 minutes to get there. So we'll be like 30 minutes late. <laughs> Oops. Marty? Are you ready for your first massage? Mm. Are you ready? Are you going to enjoy it? Yes. Good. Are you ready for your massage? Mm. Wipe your eyes. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Is he saying that he's saying? Everything's looking. That's Marty's massage bed. 
What are you getting your first massage? Are you excited? Are you sure? Okay. So Marty just finished having his very first massage. Oh, little baby is like passed out. The light is blinking in here. The power just went, so I think there's something wrong with the generator. But guys, look at my baby. He's probably having some of the best sleep of his life here on his massage bed. Oh, Marty. How are you feeling, good, Mr. Man. Ntubi? Feeling how was the massage? Good. That was great, man. Marty, how was the massage? Hmm? Marty? The massage was good. Marty, was it good? Did you like it? You fell asleep feeling nice. You still sleep half, half asleep. Hmm? Does your body feel nice? Does your body feel nice, my baby? Yes, really. Do you want to do it again? Huh? Today? Are you sure? You, you don't want to talk anymore. We will definitely be having many more spa dates um, in the future because that was really nice. You know, we usually leave Martin when we do stuff, but, you know, it's just good to just do stuff as a family as well. As much as we want our alone time, we need our family time. Um, another thing I did was I actually went back to my university. I was, I'm alumni, I'm alumna of Tech. I'm a UP alumna, so um, they had a concert. Um, it's the, called the Vice Chancellor's Concert. I used to be a part of it when I was back, when I was there. So it's just basically the orchestra of Vua, the traditional choir, and Camarato, which is the choral choir. So they come together and they put up a presentation, a showcase to the public. So we went there and my husband absolutely loved it. He loves classical music, so, so yeah. Um, here's some footage from when we went to the Vice Chancellor's concert at the University of Pretoria. Hi guys, welcome back to my vlog. It's your girl, Melly Melly Melly. I can't sing because <laughs> I actually have a flu. <clears throat> I've been trying to record all morning and uh, the voice is not happy and it is not cooperating with me at all. So I'm gonna take a break. Well, for the rest of the day, because there's nothing more I can do for it. But anyway, um, I haven't vlogged for y'all in a long time, so let's catch up. This week has been interesting. I mean, um, two days ago, I went to the studio. I decided to take things seriously and start learning how to mix and master. So I did a crash course with my friend Kudzi. He's a, a, a sound engineer. And so he was just teaching me the basics of what I need to know and how I work it. So um, I have a few clips from there, so I'll just put them here. Hi, Kuzi! Um, I, I heard you walk in, right? Mm -hmm. But I was like, nah, that's the way you go. I was traveling with your gait. How did you come in? Didn't they call you? Mm -hmm. They didn't call you. I don't think they called. Yeah, maybe they called. Hey, Lister. <clears throat> Not much. How are you doing? Oh, this thing is so What's happening? Were you on the lunch break? So it basically. Oh, and how often they come back? Yeah, I read my. So it basically reads my drums. But it's a piano, I just want. Okay. Because the piano is smooth, so, okay. so it won't be able to know the teach it with you. So it normally works. No try, but my drums are loud and then noise. Okay. Then you can actually share a tempo and okay, so the closest you can find, at least so you can get a basic delay. Okay. Delay is the same thing near reverb. No, you're planning to do that. 
buzz. So we've been. Imp- yesterday was crazy. Um, yesterday was Thursday, the the eighth of September. So I decided to. We decided to get Marty circumcised. I hadn't done it when he was a baby. Um, because yeah, well, when he was born, I had a C section. So like. Going back to the hospital was a hassle of going back to the hospital with myself, let alone going back with a kid. So I just never did it. And when I went um, to inquire, you know, the person I spoke to was like, you know, after they get past the age of, I think it was three months, it's difficult to put them under anesthetic. And there was just a bunch of stuff that she told me. So then I just gave up on it. But then my husband, um, he pushed me to get it done. And so we did it yesterday. I really thought it was going to be hectic and I thought my son would be like in pain and agony but he's fine he's he's actually normal marty except when it's like pee time because he can see the difference and obviously he's still healing um that's the only time we have a bit of trouble because he's still a bit hesitant using the toilet but otherwise all the other way he slept while throughout the night so yeah that's that's a relief so i'm happy about that i'm happy he's healing fast by next week he'll be back to normal to be honest because it hasn't been as bad as i anticipated it would be i thought like i would literally have to cradle my son for the whole day and night and i wouldn't be able to work but <clears throat> surprise surprise i can actually get some work done and then yeah, today's Friday. We're going for a concert. Um, we're going to Tux. So I'm a proud Tucky alumna. Um, I went to UP, so they're having their vice chancellor's concert today. And I know back in my day, I say back in my day because it's been almost ten years since I left uni. Has it? Okay, let me not lie. It hasn't been almost ten years since I left uni. I'm not that old. It's been twenty sixteen was my last year 2016 so it's pretty close it's about six years ago and i had the privilege of being part of three vc concerts while i was there the vice chancellor concerts so they're pretty cool because back when we did them we had the orchestra we had um the choral choir and we had our african choir which is the one i was part of so i'm looking forward to see what they've got in store for us um, i'm excited to go and be out of the house and let marty just have some fresh air because he's been cooped up in the whole house the whole day right now he's taking his nap his afternoon nap even though it's really late it's like 3 30 but like he literally knows that both mom and dad need to work and the little boy is not even biking us he's just doing his own thing he'll get his book he'll color and then when he's hungry mommy i'm hungry i'll give him some food we'll take a break to like play for a little bit and then he'll go back to his bed and just watch tv or pretend to read a book so he's being very cooperative so yeah we're gonna go for this concert i'm actually just gonna finish up some of my work right now i'm at my desk um my desk changed <clears throat> well my desk didn't change oops my desk didn't change but my husband decided to give me the bigger desk because i have more stuff than he does oh okay so this is my desk this is what it looks like right now i'm still moving in and yeah i've got a blank white wall here that i can work with when i'm shooting content and whatever whatever so yeah i'm still moving in and yeah uh, smarty's bed is usually in this room as well but he's sleeping with us since i thought he's recovering so i did him close by but otherwise yeah let me get ready for this concert because we're going all the way to pretoria guys all the way from pretoria and we stay in Joburg, so that's a bit of a distance but i'm so excited see you guys when i'm about to leave
Monty. What are you eating? What are you eating? Oh, I... An evening walk at my old university. It's really nice being here. So much is so different. Like, there are so many things that are so different. Like, new joints, new buildings. Stuff closes earlier than it used to. It's amazing though, being back here. I was telling my husband how I, I figure how I managed to keep the weight off when I was in uni because you walk guys, like we've been walking probably for the past 15 minutes and we're just trying to walk around the campus. So imagine if you're walking from class to class, it's just, it's so hectic. There's so many places you can go to, so many places. Marty found a chessboard and he wants to play with the pieces, so we're just here waiting for him to finish playing so that we can actually go home. But he's so happy that he can carry these things, so I guess he can have some fun before we leave. Um, but yeah, it's a very slow week. Um, that time I went to the VC concert, I showed you some clips of the classical music. I hope you guys noted Tom and Jerry. Did you guys actually pick that up that they were playing that song from Tom and Jerry? Or is it Looney Tunes? I think it's Tom and Jerry. They played that and I was so excited. It was like I was a kid again watching Cartoon Network. But yeah, that was so amazing. We're probably going to be trying to go see the orchestra again because we actually kind of loved it. Because music is just amazing. It's just amazing how all those instruments just come together and just do the damn things. But <coughs> yeah, guys. I'm low-key dying. Um, but I need to get work done. Um, yeah, check out my workout channel for some progress on my fitness i am doing that i can't i actually literally have a book i need to be recording right now i have a book and i think two orders for backing vocals at least there's nothing for lead vocals backing vocals i can kind of wing it because you don't have to have the best of my voice you just have to have it has to sound good and it will sound good but lead vocals just require presence and i can't do that with this kind of state that i'm in right now so yeah i'm gonna try and get some work done currently i'm just waiting for the power to come back it's coming back in 10 minutes y'all know the load shedding situation in south africa but yeah i'm gonna get some work done and we're gonna do this we're gonna do this we're gonna do this we're gonna do this um i also have a new project that i'm working on i don't know if i'm gonna share with it share it with you guys on this channel I will at some point, definitely, but maybe not yet now. Um, so I'm going to launch it and everything. And we'll see at what point that I'm going to share it with you guys, my, my new baby. I always have new babies. Um, but this one is more of a passive baby. It's just once I launch, I won't have to do too much to keep my baby going. But I will do here and there, but not too much. But yeah, so today's a busy day. I have to do my books um, I haven't done my books because I was really, really sick. I was sicker than this last week. So, yeah. And like I told you, we took my son to get circumcised. So the house has been just sick. My son's good, though. He's playing. He's he's just not happy that things happened. But he's 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 coming back. And I'm sure by the, <coughs> by the end of next week, this week, sorry, he will be back to normal. But yeah, that is my update for now. Um, don't forget to check out my other channels. I have videos dropping there as well um, frequently. So if you miss me and I'm not posting much on this channel, 
you know where to find me you know where to find me find me there so yeah anyway guys um i'll be seeing you guys soon i'm not sure what i'll be showing you guys next but i'll be seeing you guys soon and yeah <laughs>